hope you enjoy this one guys it's a topic so close to my heart and i thought i'd share it with you oh guys look i found x i'm in bed again he loves me but he's not very impressed look how tired <laughs> it's sunny so you know what that means bikini time and pool time I'm at the pool, guys. Know that it's changed since the last time you saw it, but I can't wait to zen out and hopefully swim a bit later. Hope it's not freezing. Also, run out the door without eating or cleaning my teeth or anything like that because saw that it was sunny so I apologize for how I look I just fell asleep on this deck chair just here oh living my best life right now come on jump up Good boy, good boy, big jump. Yay, you did it. Good boy. Looking at the sun, huh? Yeah. So I wanted to have a chat about Chance the Rapper's tweet about taking medication for mental illness and so many people like think tweeting things like that is helpful but it's really not because I've been in stages in my life where I would panic being alone in my house going outside in the sun wasn't gonna help me drinking water wasn't gonna help me i don't drink or smoke anyway and i can't even remember the other stuff that he said and i did talk to my family and i was still panicking in my own house and like you need to make the right decision for you it depends on the severity of your mental illness, whether it's situational due to something like grief or a huge change or something like that, or um, if it's something that is ongoing and you've tried everything you possibly could, like I've been in therapy, on and off for it's five years in January and like that helped definitely but the medication absolutely has changed my life since I started taking it in July last year literally I can't recommend it enough but please make sure you have a chat with your doctor and get assessed and make sure that it's the right thing and they're not just signing you away on medication because they want you out of the office in five minutes like make sure that you have a medical professional who's on your side and understands you and someone that you can be open with um because my doctor actually recommended antidepressants like a year before I started taking them and my family had mentioned them like years and years before and I just resisted because I was like I'm not that bad you need to want to help yourself and if you can take something every night or every morning depending on when you take it to help you to increase the serotonin in your brain 
to make you feel better and happier, why not take medication? Like, seriously. Um, but it has to be your decision. Don't feel forced to, t to take anything ever. Like, make sure it's like, you know what? I'm gonna give this a try. I've talked to my doctor, I've talked to friends who have been on it possibly, I've talked to my family, etc. Like, make sure you have a well-rounded decision before you do it, but cannot recommend it enough. I'm personally on Lexapro, um, 10 milligrams a day, life-changing, um, so, oh, need to rest this on my name, uh, I think it's getting sore. Um, so, side effects and stuff, um, nausea, vivid dreams, super tired, um, but it wasn't all that bad, felt a bit like a zombie, um, at first, um, I don't cry very often, as I've mentioned in vlogs, so it kind of numbs your emotions a little bit, but um, it depends on how severely it does that and whether you can feel um, how much you've changed for the positive or the negative, because Lexapro works for me, but it might not work for you, but... Yeah, I just wanted to have a chat about that because I think it's super important and especially around this time of year mental health normally goes lower instead of higher because there's so much pressure to be happy and switched on and doing everything that you possibly can and people always forget to take time for themselves during this period of time and that is so important as well, but I just wanted to have a chat about antidepressants and if you have any questions that I haven't answered, comment them below because I'm happy to answer them. As always, not a doctor, but I'm happy to share my experience only. Well, that's it for today's video. I didn't do too much or oh, it's been so hot that I've been sleeping the whole time but I thought it was so important to share that last clip about antidepressants because maybe one of you guys watching um are on them as well or thinking about going on them so yeah probably just gonna go downstairs have dinner and watch more stranger things but um tomorrow's vlog will be exciting because it's my sister's birthday. Yeah, I'm so excited to see her reaction to our presents. Right? Thanks so much for watching and I will see you tomorrow with my sister's birthday vlog.